protesters gathered outside the Kelowna Law Courts on Tuesday afternoon, calling for strong penalties in the case of 20-year-old Leighton Laboot, who was charged with six counts of animal abuse. I really kind of hope that, you know, and the lawyers, the judges that are walking in can see that, you know, this is something that matters, you know, this is a horrific acts that he allegedly caused. Uh, you know, with the video proof and with his uh, the, the gruesome, gruesome Instagram and media accounts that depict hundreds of images of claimation of rape, torture, murder, you know, uh, his kill kits online, him with claimation with him and a cat and a knife, you know, it's it's one of those things that this is how you, people that start with animals don't usually stop there. Obviously, I can't say that would happen for sure, but he obviously needs some psychiatric help and, uh, you know, the justice needs to step up because, you know, the lives of animals matter too and keeping our community safe should be our priority. It's just so cruel that people can just buy it for like $30 or so and then the animal has no right to choose for their own life so they can do anything they want with it and no one will really care about it. Um, so I'm really excited that he's going in front of court because of that because usually people don't care about animals. This person could buy uh, any mail and uh, nobody was questioning him. I'm completely for a law that is not uh, allowing any more selling um, animals in stores. Adopt instead of shop. His scheduled court appearance for Tuesday afternoon has been pushed over to Tuesday, September 15th. For Carstet News in Kelowna, I'm Laura Brooks.